and welcome to my channel for all my new viewers and for the ones that came back. Hi! So, you guys know it's Vlogtober and I just want to sit down and have an intro chat with you guys and let you guys know I had a fun filled weekend and I went through and vlogged the weekend to show you guys what I did. Hey, the light on. Time to get your shine on. Hey, we hot and we round on. Hey. I think I want to give y'all raw footage of everything, like at this point. But I'm doing this like this because I kind of have no other option. And I just feel like I owe it to you guys. So this is going to be Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. This is going to be a six day vlog. So y'all, go get your popcorn, sis. Go get your juice. Okay, hold on. I'll wait. Go get your favorite chip, like, go get your bait. Do what you got to do, baby, because this is going to be a real big thing. <laughs> Guys, I'm so mad. Like, my video, the sound of my video, excuse me, y'all, because I don't been moving around today, but the sound of my video keeps messing up, and I don't know what's wrong with it. And yeah, and a part of me wants to post the stuff that I have already made um, because I know it's genuine and it's real raw footage. But another part of me is just like the sound is going in and out and that's so annoying. <sighs> I don't even know what to do. But the camera is all up in my face because I have to hold the camera and I cannot even like, I can't let the my phone get too far away from me because the sound is messing up i don't know why so this weekend was fun feel um first thing we did went to the hair store me and my sister shout out to karen and um got hair to do her hair got some hair to do her hair so i did some like jumbo butterfly locks on her hair and i'll put a picture in and then after that we um took the kids to the fair we came in contact with some racist behind lady so y'all y'all know like first of all i was i had my daughter with me right and i was kind of like chasing behind her because you know she's in a discovery mode or whatever and i was trying to be like you know come on baby or whatever and we were in line and there were two lines and the lady or the girl who's behind the um, whatever ticket box she was like, next person, next person. And when I when I finally heard it and that caught my attention, um, I was like, I was like, I'm sorry, ma'am. I, I have to get my baby. So I got got Nori. It's not like she ran too far. I just got her arm or whatever. And we walked up there and I was like, ma'am, I'm sorry, I just had to get my baby. And she looked at me and rolled her eyes. And she leaned over to talk to the lady who was next to her, who looked like, um, like she eats cigarettes for lunch she eat them like virginia slims newports and marlboros like she just chop them up eat them throw some little cow's milk in there and she she looked like one of them like her mouth was a raisin in the sun so she gonna lean over to her and she's like i just want to punch her in the face hello excuse me ma'am know that i am I have a doctorate in reading lips. Matter of fact, I don't think I have very many friends who can't read lips because I need for you to be able to stay abreast when something is going on. We could be in a place and my homegirl or my front, my friend, my sister, whatever, they could just mouth to me like, I'm going to be like, oh, it's time for us to go. Me and my friends, we want to go. Because reading lips is everything. So when she said that, I was like, who are you going to punch in the face? Her eyes got why and it was cocked like a pistol i said you know what because i just y'all it was so much bad energy there like i had to go change my jacket and good thing i keep my little stones i had to pray like lord we gotta get this together y'all i was just if 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 my daughter wasn't so excited about going y'all i would have been like you know what let's go home and my niece, she's she's a teenager, so she understands. 
you know, and I want them to understand the value of your money because they was acting like they really didn't want us to, you know, they really didn't want us there, but they wanted our money. But that's how you cut people at the neck. You know what I'm saying? You don't spend your money when you're not worth it. <sighs> that's why we want to stand because, like I said, I want to teach them, like, you know, you ain't got to spend your money with these folks. They don't like you, fine. And she said something else, so I really wanted to wait until she got up out of that box. But, you know, I was like, mm, I got too much stuff going on. So many bigger fish to fry. Oh, yeah, and at the fair, y'all had a little carnival thing. The man was trying to get, like, he was like, you so pretty. And I was like, okay, thank you. And he, like, Nori, she was ready to get off the ride. So he was, like, trying to get her off the ride. I'm like, oh, let me through. I'm like, so I just snatched my baby from him. I'm like, okay, thank you. And it's like he tried to keep his hand there too long. I'm like, don't make me hurt you. And I'm just like, he seemed real pedophilish to me. It was a man who walked up to us with a camera, like, can I take a camera? Uh, can I take a picture of your baby? I was like, no. Um, he was like, well, can we still? I said no. So I'm like, I feel like they had some other little operation going on in there, and I didn't like that either. You know, I like to pay, be trying to pay attention to everything. So y'all, then we got in line, and it was um, this um, Indian woman. She was being real nasty and mean. She thought she could get in front of us, and we, you know, just real entitled. Like we ain't supposed to say nothing. I'm like, no, and no, and no. And y'all, I'm just like, Lord, why in the world? Just why? So I was like, you know what? <laughs> Let me bring her on down. Pray for my protection. Let my baby have fun. And y'all, by the time we left, I mean, I was ready to go. So it was good that I had gone to the spa after the fact. So next thing we did was we came home and my sister and I, we went to the spa. Mind you, previous, the day before that, we tried to go to the, to the spa, y'all, but everything in the world crazy was happening. And for some reason, my sister does not listen to, like, um, cautionary signs. She doesn't, it's nothing for her. Like, y'all, we were supposed to go to a costume birthday party. Shout out to Rashida. Happy birthday, boo. We were supposed to go there, was getting dressed up, everything. Everything went crazy. By the time we were ready to go and we could have been there, it was just way too late because the drive in itself was so far and it, it was just too late. So I'm like, oh my gosh. After that, we decided to go to the spa and um, my sister's friend who she had invited, she was going to come with us. And I'm like, okay. Um, so once she came, Little by little, everything just started going crazy. We went ahead and still went to the spa. By the time we got there, um, certain times at the spa, okay, so it's before 12. So you can do everything there before 12, meaning all of the extra services, they're available. Um, but after 12, that stuff shuts down. So all you can really do is go in and steam in the saunas. And you can eat until 2 a.m. We weren't going to be able to do exactly what we needed to do anyways. So um, we waited and we wind up after the carnival affair or whatever you guys want to call it. We wind up going to um, back to the spa and it was just my sister and I this time. Y'all, we had the most relaxing, euphoric experience. Um, and that was her first time, but I used to go like once a month. Um, after having Noor, I haven't been able to get up there and just go and just moving around and life changes and everything. So I'm so happy I was able to, you know, re-experience everything. Um, and we had gone at a reasonable time, so we were able to get our services. So we got a steam done, um, body scrub, all types of good stuff. The spa's name is Jeju. It's a Korean spa. Um, before I even went to the spa, y'all, I went out to the club with my sister for, like, the first time ever. It was so fun. We had gone to two places. We had gone to 
go and support people from um, a city where we lived. Um, I don't want to call it our hometown because it's technically not, but we lived there for a few years. Uh, well, for a while growing up. So we grew up with these people. We went to go and celebrate and go and support. And um, I, I talked my sister into going and then she went to go someplace. So I was like, this only right. And we had gone and we had such a good time. One place, the first place that we had gone, one of my friends had gone and then she went home. And then the last place, um, my sister's friend had came. Um, so it was good. I went dress shopping. My mom up and she was like, it's time to go. You know, I, I made you an appointment to go wedding dress shopping. So she told me about going wedding dress shopping, like out of nowhere. So I'm like, well, okay, it was about 12 something. Um, and so the appointment was there at like two. And so we had to rush around, you know, get dressed, whatever else. Um, uh, probably like, it had to be about 12.31, so we didn't have much time to get ready. I was looking like Crash Bandicoot and Little Bill mixed together, and I was just like, how much time do I have? So we went ahead and went, and, you know, I tried on a couple dresses. I'm going to show you guys a few of the dresses that I tried on. So I tried on the dresses, and um, I did a lot, you know, spin around and show you guys a few. I'm not sure which ones I'm going to post and which ones I'm not going to post because I haven't completely chosen which one I'm going to have. And you guys can let me know which ones you like. The sound in some of those videos are not good. And I'm trying, y'all, really. Um, I feel like this is God pushing me forward to just go ahead and invest in a camera. Um, but I, um, I'm manifesting to make a certain amount of money from YouTube and let my YouTube be able to to pay for my camera but maybe it's just gonna pay for it on the back end i don't know but i need to be able to get some good vlogging and some good um footage because yeah i don't want to short you guys and you know i want to go all the way yeah that is kind of during the week kind of um brought the quality of my videos down and it was making me very upset Boom. So by the time I tried on some dresses and stuff, y'all, I was so hungry. I was so hungry. I couldn't even focus on my emotions and how I actually felt about the dresses. So I don't know. Um, then after that, we left there and we went to a Mexican restaurant called Papitos or something. And it was funny because it was next to another restaurant called Papa Do's. It was Papa Do's and Papa Do's or something like that. And it was funny because it rhymes or whatever. Corny, I know, but it was. Oh, yesterday, which was Monday, I had gone to the Cheesecake Factory in Lenox Square. And it was so good. And I had some cauliflower. Um, the fried cauliflower so it's made like fried chicken. And that's what it'll give you the um put you in a mind of and y'all i know they say everything tastes like chicken and it's just like it's like sir are you eating alligator like that's disgusting what does that even taste like tastes like chicken like oh my god are you eating like penguin what the heck is that what does it taste like tastes like chicken like no seriously if you're going vegan or something like that and you need something good that's something so good fried cauliflower Peace. Hold on, baby. Can you be patient? Please peace. be patient. Peace. Okay, I'll give it to you. She said peace, please. So, peace. So, y'all, I went ahead and today, which is Wednesday, I went to a, a mixer. They were playing jazz and, you know, it was so beautiful, guys. Like, it was like super intimate and calm and um i don't know i would have said it was like a good it was a good place to kind of network but more so just relax mm, like 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 flashing like 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 And here is the footage, live and in color. <laughs> <laughs>
So guys, we are leaving Beauty Master. I did um, manage to go to the DMV. I don't think that they were um, allowing too much um, recording going on. So this is what we really went to the hair store to get some hair so that I can do these butterfly locks in my sister's hair and they came out cute. Jeju. Um, we're gonna go there. Um, they have different sauna rooms. I'm gonna show you guys around if they allow me to, uh, to put my phone. We're also gonna try some of their in house food, which is Raymond and um, fresh fruit. And I love them there. So, this is gonna be my sister and her friends' first time. So, we are gonna catch back up with you guys and tell you how our experience has been. See ya! You got matching sneaker bars. <laughs> you got the almond. White and I have no shoes. I got on my white. <laughs> my sister wrapped me up so good. She said on my white too, and that's not what it's say. <laughs> my baby gonna lie on the screen. You hear me? <laughs> no, yours says white. Mine say all men. They're white uh, sneakers though. Well, I had you though. <laughs> I had you either way. What you talking about? Hey, my sister's like. <laughs> Hey, North. So we are. Uh, we didn't 
go to the spa last night, so I didn't record that part. Excuse me, excuse me. But I'm gonna put it on tomorrow's vlog. So you guys stay tuned for everything. It's gonna be amazing. Hopefully we have a ball, like. I should have took a picture of something that I had called a chicken and waffle. Um, what did you eat? Nachos. And my sister had a donut burger. But I forgot to take a picture of it, so. I probably shouldn't even told you guys that. That's my dinner burger. So this fair is outside of a... It's like an... Our vibes are, are hella off, guys. Okay, so we're at the fair. It's in like supermarket parking lot. Yes. Nora's having a blast. She just got on a huge um, little kitty roller coaster. Yes? No, that's for big people. That's for big kids. So y'all, I know y'all can barely hear me in the videos, but the vibes were hella off there. Hey guys, so we made it back. Wait, I gotta welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, the life of joy, and we have made it to the spa. Say hi, sister. Gang gang. <laughs> Hey guys, so we can't go anything past this point, but here is the shoe locker. Excuse me, I don't want to hit you. Here's our shoe locker. Oh, this okay. is for my YouTube channel. Oh, really? <laughs> I, oh, okay. okay. I like no problem. It's, it's, a, it's a part of the wristband right here. So you get your little key, you put it in your, your shoes in here, and then I put my key around my wrist and my ankle down here. Um, they give you your own. Okay. Okay. And you, you could just lock it and then yeah. And so of course, um, past this point, let me show you everything. No shoes are allowed and um, we can't record. So I'm gonna let you guys see once we get inside of the sauna room. What's up, it's okay. What's up, it's okay. So sister, this is your first time here. Did I put you on? Okay, what would you rank this place from one to 10, honestly? Honestly, this is so cool, guys. So, the inside of this is covered with silver and gold and different stones. And they're all hot, of course, because. Indeed, it is a sauna. Um, sorry if my lighting is bad, but yeah, of course I can't bring the ring light in there. Um, so we're trying each one of them, and I, um, we are just so lucky to get a couple of these alone. But I'm just gonna post the information that's on the outside of the um, saunas, and then I'll post them so you guys can see the different ones. But I can't, of course, record because some of them have people inside of them. So we're, we're gonna do that. Taryn, be careful, your cup is behind you. Girl, the floor is so hot though, we might start boiling. So the area in the back has like a personal steam room and it has all of the other other personal services but where these large saunas are is called the common or public area and so here are pictures of the different ones that we went inside and like the ceilings of them and if you pause them you can read the benefits of each room and what it's good for but we did try each one of them and it was so awesome guys like seriously. Okay guys, so we are about to leave. It is 3 a.m. So we've been oh. here since like 10. Yes. We've been here since 10. Actually, we're gonna stay here. Yeah, and people do stay right here actually. It was so cool. We feel rejuvenated. So yeah. <laughs> okay guys, so we are at the bridal shop. Say hi mommy. Say hi, Tim. So we're gonna see if we can find my dress today. Um, I'm super excited. I've never been here before. We are in Kennesaw. We're in Kennesaw. So once we try on the dresses, I am going to get on here and show y'all. 
hopefully the lighting seems like it's pretty good but we're gonna show you the dresses and write down in the comments which ones you like best okay love you guys so mom wants me to get some sort of like I don't know how do you like it is the question. This is number, it's really number four, guys. I wouldn't mind. It's too emotional. You're so silly. Try on the dress I asked you to. You found a flit and fit. I'm in a mermaid. Yes. That's the mermaid. My name is not Steven Spielberg, sister. Go ahead. <laughs> yes. So we just left the dress shop. Um, it was pretty dope. We're at a place called Papacitas. We're going to have some um, oh, outfit of the day. We're going to have some Mexican food. So. Yeah, that's good. And I thought something was This place is cute, my guys. Cute. Okay, so I'm gonna show you guys what I order whenever I get there. And I'm gonna post a couple of pictures of. Oh god. I'm gonna post a couple of pictures of my dress, dresses that I tried on. Guys, so we chose to sit outside. Say hi. Oh. Yeah. Hey, this is super cute. Oh, these pants have my butt out a little bit. My thigh. Okay, so let me see what am I gonna order. If you want to heat it, we can share it with these. Okay. This. A heater. This one? Yes, yeah, this thing is huge. But it has. <laughs> so you know that was for me, so I had a little snail. I had a little good food. Hi guys, so I went out to eat at some place with a couple of my friends called Two Urban Leaks. I am now walking downtown. We're going to some little jazz, little mixer, little thing. I'm definitely going to network, I'm get information from different people for my business. Um, yeah, never been. Super excited. Oh. Yeah, I don't even know what the name of this place is called, guys. I have no idea. So we're going for a temperature check. Yes. Thank you. So, I'm excited, guys. So the ambiance and the lighting and everything was just so awesome guys. This was an amazing jazz set. They did ask for us not to record the stage and everything so I did get a small glance of 
how everything was set up, but of course, to be respectful, I did not record um, completely. So here's some of the audio, and it sounds so good. Monday.